We met, I expressed satisfaction at the looks on your faces. Now that the tables have been turned, I am positively incarnadine. Brother, you always look like that. It's why we're here, remember? Hmm. True. As for these adventurers, I still haven't figured it out. Why have you come all this way? Gold? Some self-appointed noble quest? Destroy? No, we don't wish to destroy the Ten Towns. We just want to educate them in the manners and methods of their diplomats. Our goal is the unification and solidarity of all the dispossessed freaks and half-breeds of Faerun, and the eventual enslavement of those who opposed us. At this point, I think we're supposed to say something to the effect of, you're too late to stop us. Isn't that the way it works in the storybooks, sister? Come now, Isaire. You know I don't like to read. Of course, how forgetful of me. Now, where was I? Something about storybooks. <sighs> well, whatever it was, I've forgotten it now. Enough of this stupidity. Would it be all right if I killed them now, sister? It sounds perfect to me, brother. Farewell, mercenaries. Yes. Onward. Yes. Yes. What is it? Yes. Huh? Sounds good. What is it you need? Yes, Mala Ijares. You want me? Speak your mind. I'm here. Ready. At your command. Onward. I'm ready. Very well. I'm ready. And willing. I understand. Dear sister, this isn't going quite as well as I had planned. Perhaps we should fall back. You always were the first to flinch, brother. Very well.
I am here. Ready and waiting. Very well. What? Painted the pool. Well done, an excellent maneuver. Wouldn't you say, sister? Ah! Silence your incessant chatterers there! Kill them! My humble apologies, sister. After you. Yes? Ustar Elixir. Za Usta. Very well. Yes. So be it. didn't come into Kaldahar much after the Legion had broken. So much of his work had been lost that his life seemed wasted in his old age. Once I asked him what had happened when the hand vanished on that fateful day. As he looked down from the safety of the Mage's Tower, he watched chunks of stone fall away and disappear. Eventually, trails of ethereal fire raced up the fingers, leaving lavender smoke and nothing more. When the haze cleared, his tower alone survived, hanging in the sky as a reminder of what once stood at the center of the valley. Though I barely remember the adventurers now, we all remember how important they were to our lives. They stayed with us for a while longer, but moved with the changing of the seasons. Soon after the heroes had gone, 
Isolor planted a garden at the base of the Great Oak, for he told us the adventurer's memory should remain associated with the realm of the living. And as I now realize, it is for the sake of the living that I now leave my home, just as my mentor did when he came here, and just as those adventurers did when they saved all of Icewind Dale. There are many roads left to travel, many deeds left to do, before the end of my days. <laughs>